there's not a person out there who hasn't done something he or she regrets, but what if you had to wear that mistake on your skin for everyone to see? Here's Nick Watt. Some of us tattoo our skin for love. Angelina inked a big old Billy Bob. Christina Aguilera had Jordan Bratman's initials tattooed on her lower back. Eva Longoria tattooed her husband's jersey number on her neck. Rihanna and Chris Brown, single matching stars. Others tattoo for shock. Lady Gaga just inked her neck in public at her fragrance launch. Others tattoo for, well, uh, I'm not exactly sure. And others, yep, just get tattooed for money. Yes, money. Meet Billy. He's a hard-working guy, a mailroom clerk in Alaska, father of five, who's fallen on hard times in the past, struggled to keep food on the table and a roof over their head, and resorted to the final frontier in advertising, skin advertising. I just didn't want to see my kids on the street. That would have broke my heart. Billy has gone from this, pre-ink, to this. Oh my goodness. We had to blur some of those racy logos. Porn's quite a bold word to have tattooed on your face. That isn't a, a good thing to have porn on your face. You know, I'm not happy about that. Billy now has 22 tattoos on his face. For some, he was paid as little as $800, and he regrets it. He might not look it, but he's a sweet, sweet guy. Got his first paid tattoo to cover bills after he donated a kidney to a stranger. When I thought it would be nice to help him. Wow, that's an incredible thing to do. Oh, thank you. But now he wants to clean up his face. He'd like a better job. He has words like, you know, porn tattooed on his cheek. That's a problem. Professor Christopher Zachary is a dermatologist at UC Irvine and he removes okay. tattoos like this one. No pain, but yeah, no, no pain. gain. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at that. Brittany has O and C on her, well, there and love on her finger. Oh my god. <laughs> to remove just the OC will cost over $2,000. Do you have any tattoos? I do not. Do you think I should get one? I do. <laughs> a little I butterfly? Just... Okay, Nick, so let's... That's what I have. Ah, oh, what a pretty specimen. But, in my defense, I was only 18. No. That's Billy Gibby. Billy, you've got a problem, boy. I hope they paid you well. This would be, I, I think, a medical nightmare. In a couple of years, laser technology will have caught up with Billy's face, and he might be in luck. For now... I think we can get porn out of his face. We do have the blues and the greens up here. It's a tough one. Black is easiest. Get black if you're gonna look back like Carrie. She's a pretty girl, but I, that's, that's really gonna cause her problems. Uh, does she have a job? That's Carrie. Sweet Mormon mom from small town Utah. It was like a, a, a somebody had taken a big old stamp and went... You know, just like, that was it. <laughs> GoldenPalace.com paid her $15,000, and they made that go a long way in Utah. They're a family of simple needs and pleasures. Carrie did this to get a better place for her son to live. They're a family with a sense of humor. You know, your husband's, you know, moving in for a kiss, and, you know, and he sees, you know... He kind of chuckles. I, I have to admit, he does kind of giggle a little bit. Seven years later, you'll notice she's now nearing the end of a lengthy process of having it removed. Six laser treatments so far, about 800 bucks spent, just one more to go. Carrie discovered the tattoo was career limiting. For good or, or, or ill, if two people are going for a job, are you going to give the job to the exactly. lady with the tattoo on her head or the other one? Or the other one that looks normal, right, right. Billy just got a tattoo from PornUp.com, who paid Billy nearly $4,000 for that piece of skin real estate. But what kind of company would pay to advertise like this? Isn't it taking advantage of people in bad circumstances? Well, it's not keeping CEO Jeff Corman up at night. I mean, I wonder if people think, wow, this is a weird company that's going to pay some guy to tattoo their company name on his arm. For the amount that it would cost, it certainly would be worth the exposure. I don't believe for a moment that we took advantage of them. 45 million of you out there have tattoos. 17% of you regret it. Did you get to a point where you wished it wasn't on your face?
face. Sometimes, like when I go out to nice dinners and stuff like that, it got a little bit hard to, to kind of cover it up. For Billy, no more face. He means it. I wouldn't even consider it. Even if somebody offered me a million, I wouldn't do it for the face. For Eva Longoria, I'm guessing tattoo regrets set in three years later when she got divorced. Rihanna, well, there was one star for Chris. She just added a few more after they split. And Chris had this tattooed on his neck. Who knows what that means? And Angelina, well, of course, Billy Bob's ancient history. She's had that tattoo removed and covered it with the coordinates for the birthplaces of her kids with Brad. That's grown up. Oh, and just for the record, I don't regret mine. A butterfly on my back, a discreet badge of a misspent youth.